Hello viewers, welcome back. So this is the third video as part of our series on Tally's latest release, release 5.0. So we are covering the features that are provided in Tally Prime. Now for the first time, Tally is offering a value-added plugin services starting from release 5.0. So in this release, Tally is providing you one value-added service which is Tally Capital. So let us go to Tally and explore the features and facilities provided by Tally Capital. And also we will understand how we can download or activate the Tally Capital plugin and its other features we will explore. Starting with release 5.0, Tally is giving value added services integrated with Tally Prime. So the first of the value added service by plugin that Tally provides is the Tally Capital. Now I have already enabled the Tally Capital. If you are on release 5.0, once you update it to the latest release 5.0, then if you want to download this Tally Capital as the first plugin that Tally is offering, how do we download? Click on F1 under F1 menu we have this menu called tally plugins when you click on tally plugins tally is going to give the list of all the plugins that tally is going to keep providing as we keep upgrading to the latest releases or probably tally would give more plugins in the same release also so for us to know what are the new plugins that tally is offering if you can click here and also we will get it through notification. So I will cover in a separate video about the new notification that Tally is provided in release 5.0. So you will have a list of this and if you notice here the status is already loaded. If you want to load this all you have to do is just press enter and then you can load it. So once the Tally plugin of Tally Capital is enabled we will see what are the features that Tally provides. Click on Tally Capital. Two very important facilities that Tally Capital provides is one, we can check our credit score and also we can apply for loan. Now on the right hand side button bar, if you see you have these buttons, it says first, let's see what's new. So when you click on what's new, you have this new feature that has been enhanced in the Tally Capital. Let me just quickly read this out. So eligibility as per bank statement, basically this determines your loan eligibility by uploading relevant bank statements for a more accurate loan offer. The second is free credit score. Check your credit score for free sole proprietors only using CRIF, Highmark or Sybil. The third feature is enhanced EMI calculator. Calculate your loan EMI using new calculator which supports both flat and reducing interest rates. The next one is loan management. View upcoming EMI transaction history and repayment schedule for your loans with Flexi Loans. So for that, the navigation path is go to Gateway of Tally, Tally Capital, click on Loan Application and select Loan Application with status as Loan Disperse. Once the loan is dispersed, you can actually keep track of your EMI transaction repayment schedule and the EMI history. The next one is Partner Details. Find partner contact detail within the loan application for assistance. Just in case if you have any clarification in the loan application interface, so you can get in touch with our your tally partner so that tally partner will assist you in moving forward. That's about what's new. Now if you see it says that enhanced EMI calculator when you just come out of this again on the right hand side button bar you have this button called loan EMI calculator. So click on loan EMI calculator and you have this a quick loan EMI calculator. So let us say you want to go in for a loan of 25 lakhs at the reduced rate of. So if you want to apply flat rate, again you see on the right hand side button bar you have flat rate wise. Let's do the reducing rate. Let's say reducing rate is going to be 9.5% and the tenure let's say 20 years. And the moment you enter, you will get EMI per month, total interest on loan, total amount payable and the corresponding flat rate. So the, the corresponding flat rate is going to be 
6.19%. Now, if you want to see the loan EMI, it's so handy that just click view loan EMI and you're going to get your loan EMI also. Month wise EMI, principal breakup and interest amount breakup and also it is going to give you the outstanding. So before even you go for a loan, you will have complete information about your loan liability, your EMI payment, how much of principal you are repaying, what is the interest amount that you are going to pay on a monthly basis. It will also give you the loan information. So very, very handy, very useful. We go back. Let us see how you can check your credit score. Click on credit score. It will ask you for your mobile number. Enter the mobile number, accept and you are going to get an OTP on your mobile enter the OTP and press enter. So it is going to give you the name of the person, PAN number. And also I had actually during the beta, I had checked this. So that is why it says that on 12th of August 24, I had actually checked my credit score. So if you want a new credit report, you can refresh the current credit score so that it will update as on date. Since I already have a credit report, I can go and refresh and get it updated first time when you're going then you can basically it will open up and then you have to provide these information for obtaining the credit score so once you specify your email id the detailed credit score will be emailed to you to the id that you have specified here so let me just refresh so it is now fetching the data from the credit bureau now it says the refreshed or the updated credit score i have obtained on 15th of September. You can select this and press enter and it is going to give you the list of all the accounts credit score. Since it is free, you can just try this out and then you can view your credit score rating. If you are looking for a business loan, you can apply for loan from this application itself. When you click on loan application, so basically it is going to give you the basic detail based on the company's information. It says information for reference and all this information you will get and it depends on the company's data. This is a demo data that I am using. So that is why, you know, from this, whatever data it is there, it is just picking up the information and providing. I mean, like basically you can just try this out, even though you are not applying for any loan, you will get a fair idea of how this uh, app is functioning and how beautifully it is getting integrated with your accounting information with this plugin. You can check on eligibility. So you specify the detail here and then you can check for eligibility. And you will see here that, you know, basically you can check the eligibility as per bank statement or you can check the eligibility as per the company data, tally data. So based on the tally data, tally will compute the relevant information. It will pick up from your data and then it is going to give you the eligibility criteria. A brief about Tally Capital is that you have this welcome note here. Basically, it says upfront loan eligibility, easy application process, data privacy and security. Now, if you want to visit the website, you can just click on visit website and from within Tally, it will take you to the to the website where you can just fill up all this information, request for a call back and take it forward. Now, let us say for some reason you want to opt out of this plugin, you can opt out if you want to opt out, how do you opt out? Click on F1 help, click on tally plugin. And now when you press enter, you have this two option, right? So it says tally capital offers an unsecured loan with flexible terms and hassle free process exclusively for tally customers. Okay. So when you click on opt out, it will automatically remove this plugin from your tally prime. But at later point in time, let us say you want to opt in for this tally capital. Now you can't do it on your own. Like the first time that you have opted in, in case if you want to re opt in to the tally capital, then you have to contact your tally partner who will help you to opt in or enable tally capital on your tally prime for you. I hope. This wonderful plugin of Tally Capital is going to immensely help all of you as business person to one, track your credit score, credit rating, and also do a quick EMI calculation for any loan that you are planning to go in for. And what's more, at the comfort of your office, with the help of Tally Capital, you can apply for a loan. So thank you all once again for staying till the end.
see you all in the next session thank you very much